Hey guys, what's up? I'm going to be looking at Funniest Time Tales Part 8. We have done episodes 1 through 7, and now we're going to do 8. Let's do this. This is going to be the funniest Time Tales in the world. So if you guys want more of these, be sure to smash that like button, and we will do so. And also guys, TikTok is no longer going to be on the daytime block for a little while. I'm replacing it temporarily with animated stories, so we'll do more of those. Alright, let's do this. This is Funny Slime Bills Part 8. Left lane must... Left lane? Wait, what do you want me to do? Do you want me to go to left or should I not? Is the left lane closed? Why are these signs so confusing? What is the left lane must left lane? It's supposed to be helpful. <sighs> this is just... This is just so perverted. <laughs> Guys... If you, if the girl is going to use the stall, please do not climb up the stall to look at her. Give her some privacy, guys. Not, do not do this. We got this sign that is the stupidest sign ever. It says here, do not breathe un under the water. I'm sure all, I'm sure nobody is stupid enough to attempt to breathe under the water because we can't breathe under the water. Why would you breathe underwater and we don't have gills? There's no, if we don't have those, why are we gonna try to breathe under the water? All the water will just get sucked up into our lungs and we'll die because we'll lack of oxygen because we're not fish. Only sea creatures can breathe underwater. We're land creatures. If we can breathe air, we're not water breathers. I mean, unless you're a whale, whales are mammals. I think whales and dolphins are probably the only sea creatures that can breathe both air and water. Because, you know, whales have to have, have to go up to the surface every once in a while because they have to have air. Because, you know, they're mammals. Dolphins get their air by swimming fast into the ocean and going up to the water, up the water to air. <sighs> oh, this is just bad placement. This is... So this store is called Authorized Service Shop. But yeah, when you abbreviate it, it literally says <laughs> ass. Get it? Authorized Service Shop. That's what it means. Ass. It's just awful placement. I think you need to shut down your store, sir. Please no dogs. We are afraid of the goats. Misspelled weird. The apostrophe is right. Let me correct this. Please no dogs. We're afraid of dogs, or please no dogs, you'll scare the goats. Because you just placed, this is just awful design. This is not a very good, this is not a grammar. This is not the proper grammar. We don't have the apostrophe there, and that does not make sense. It's supposed to not make signs so confusing. It's supposed to be helpful. Alright, this sign is just plain stupid. The dog has a gun and refuses to take his medicine. What kind of what kind of person would give a dog a gun? And what universe does a does a dog know how to use a gun? Come on. A dog has a gun and he's refusing to take his medicine. So what the dog's gonna kill himself just because he doesn't take his medicine? Come on. That what kind of what stupid person would give a dog a gun anyway? The sign is just plain stupid. <laughs> Alright, danger. Please do not feed or molest. Gators cannot be tamed and feed them. Can on the mistaking hand for a hand dowdy Florida law prohibits the feeding or molesting of alligators. What? Who in their right mind would do that? Bestiality is completely illegal in America. Please do not follow the sign, guys. We see the sign just reported to the police. Because apparently you're not supposed to do this. Nikki, wait, just let's flirt with you. Oh, wow, I would definitely want to go to Irish Pub. But wait, wait, wait. If you look closely, here's what the sign really says. The naked truth about our waitresses is that they only flirt with you to get a better tip. Does that mean they don't actually like me? They don't think I'm cute? 
This is misleading and this is clickbait in real life. Attention, toilet only for disabled, elderly, pregnant children. Thank you for shopping with us. So where in this world can you get a disabled, elderly, pregnant child to use this toilet? And what about adults? What if, what if, what about them? They're the ones who need to pee. Like, what if you had too much McDonald's? If you had way too much McDonald's coffee and you, and you just gotta use it. And also, where, why are there no commas in this? You gotta have commas on here. Let me fix this in. Attention, toilet, toilet only for disabled, comma, elderly, comma, pregnant, comma, children. Thank you. If you're going to pay me money, give it to me now, because I just completely fixed the sentence. People are eating children in this area. Please leash your dog and claim after them. Thank you. Again, you need a comma on this one. Let me fix this sentence for you again. Ch people are eating, comma, children playing in this area. Add playing to the sentence. Please leash your dog and claim after them. Thank you. There you go. That'll be twenty dollars. <laughs> when you're so stupid, you wanna you don't read the sign thoroughly. Win a free ride in a police car just by shoplifting from this store. Lucky winners can also get their name in the newspaper and for their family and friends to see. Friends and family see. Won't mommy proud of you? Hmm, I wonder why you put the sign up. It's the same thing as getting arrested. So you're so if you're if you're not looking if you're not reading the sign thoroughly, it's literally getting arrested for shoplifting from the store. Will mom be so proud of you? Yes, she'll be so proud of you. And after which, when she bails you, you'll be grounded for a month. Next time, guys, if you see something like this, read it thoroughly before shoplifting from the store. Because apparently you're going to get arrested. This is just, this is for IQ level of 4 and lower. Oh, this is for a 2.0 grade point average and lower. Because apparently you can't. This is just plain idiocy. This is so much, this is clickbait, and this is misleading. <laughs> we got this place that says go slow, accident porn area. Did you mean accident prone area? And what is accident porn area? Like, did you just find some, and you gotta put a sign up that tells people that this there's accident porn found here. Anyone caught exiting through the store will be asked to leave. Jokes on you, I'm leaving anyway. Like, you're leaving. Anyone caught exiting through the store will be asked to leave the store, even if you're already leaving to begin with. You're just wasting breath, good sir. Notice, this is a drug free workplace. But is it bullshit free, though? Drug free workplace in a pharmacy. Hmm. This is just plain stupid. According to, according to the background, this is a pharmacy where there are drugs everywhere. So if it's a drug-free workplace, hmm, did you mean a legal drug-free workplace? Because if you meant, unless you meant that, this is a stupid sign. Just, t t just take down the sign or just shut down your store. Because apparently this is not a drug-free workplace. You're in a pharmacy. Oh my goodness, perfect place for me to go. We got Hotel Google in a different area. Oh my goodness, Hotel Google, that's for me. Do you guys want to go to Hotel Google? Comment below. But anyway, guys, that's all for today. If you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys want more of these, be sure to hit that like button in the face and subscribe to my channel. Tomorrow we got some animated stories for daytime. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. And bye, guys.